By the end of this video, you'll be able to identify, classify triangles by angles, and classify triangles by sides, like acute angle, right angle triangle, obtuse angle triangle, equilateral triangle, isosceles triangle, and scalene triangle. Stick around and watch till the end. Hi, I'm Nack. Hi, I'm Tack. Welcome to Nack Tack 910. Different types of triangles. Let's learn about different triangles today. But what do you mean by different triangles? Aren't all triangles the same? <laughs> yeah, they're all triangles. But depending on the measure of angles and lengths on sides, they're named differently. Hmm. Interesting. We'll learn that in a bit. But first, you said you know about a triangle. Can you tell me what a triangle is? A triangle has three sides and three angles. So, today we're going to learn about different types of triangles based on these sides and angles. Look at this triangle. Has all three sides equal and all three angles are also equal, each measuring 60 degrees. Such a triangle is called an equilateral triangle. These little lines on the sides show they're all equal. The word lateral means side. So equilateral means equal sides. Equilateral triangle means one, all three sides are equal. Two, all three angles are equal. Three, each angle measures 60 degrees. Look at this triangle. It has two equal sides and two equal angles. So this is an isosceles triangle. This symbol means angles are equal. An isosceles triangle has one, two equal sides, two, two equal angles. Yep, that's right. Do you think this is an isosceles triangle? Two sides measure three centimeters and two angles measure 65 degrees. So yep, this is an isosceles triangle. Nack, we learned about three sides are equal. That's equilateral triangle. Two sides are equal. That's isosceles triangle. What if all the sides are different and not equal to each other? Yep, you guessed it. That's a scale and triangle. A triangle in which all three sides are different lengths and all three angles measure different is called a scalene triangle. This is a scalene triangle because all three sides are of different lengths, five centimeters, six centimeters, and three centimeters, and all three angles are of different measures, 30 degrees, 65 degrees, and 85 degrees. Now that we have learned different types of triangle based on sides, Tell me what type of triangle this is. Friends, do you want to help me? Let's do it together. Hmm. Two sides are six centimeters. So two equal sides and two equal angles each measure 35 degrees. So this is an isosceles triangle, right? That's correct. Now that we learned triangle based on sides, Let's see different triangles based on angles. Do you remember an acute angle? Yeah, an angle measuring less than 90 degrees is called an acute angle. Right. So if a triangle has all the angles less than 90 degrees, meaning each angle is an acute angle, then it's called an acute triangle. In this triangle ABC, each of its angles is less than 90 degrees. So this is an acute angle triangle. All right, what's a right angle? An angle with 90 degrees is a right angle, right? <laughs> Correct, you know it, just be confident. So if I draw a triangle with a right angle, say B is a right angle, and if I draw a triangle like this, then this is called a right angle triangle. 
An obtuse triangle is one in which of its three angles measure greater than 90 degrees. That's one of its angle, an obtuse angle. This triangle ABC is an obtuse triangle because one of its angle, which is angle B, is an obtuse angle measuring 120 degrees. Here's a summary of what we learned today. Types of triangles. Classify by angle. Acute triangle, which is all three angles, measure less than 90 degrees. Then we have right triangle, which is one angle measures exactly 90 degrees. Then we have the obtuse triangle, which is one angle measures more than 90 degrees. We also learned about classify by sides. Equilateral triangle, which is all three sides have the same length. Isosceles triangle, at least two sides have the same length. Scalene triangle, all three sides have different lengths. That's right. Math is easy and fun. Understand your concepts with a little bit of practice and loads of fun. Make sure you share it with your friends and family to have math fun. Like and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to click the notification bell for more fun videos.